Hi friends, uh, it's a pleasure uh, telling that uh, today we have beautiful, beautiful sound here in the Yucatan and always with uh, open hearts to share with you the Mayan updates from the 22 to the 28th of July this year. So in this time uh, we are uh, still uh, under the influence of the first Mayan month that is called Pope. Pope who means uh, the map of the time. Pop is a, is a symbol who represents the time we are on these days now, but in this time, the influences are so important, so connected with two special uh, beings that we call the planets in our solar system. One is uh, the moon. And the next day, we we'll want to have a, an impressive uh, eclipse of the moon, who is very important worldwide, especially in all the area of Asia, is going to be a, an, an impact, in a shock, because it's going to be an eclipse very long, more than a, a, one hour. It's one hour, 23 minutes around. And this is very important to remind us that Mother, Mother Earth, Mother Moon, needs our attention, needs our love and respect and honor. So why not to think to do something special during these days? As an example, to go to sources of water, for example, you have close by a lake or a river, a little stream of water, you know, uh, even a little creek. Uh, you can go there, you can go there to, to connect with the water. It's very important these days because we can return to the mother our love, our honor. If you don't have a chance to connect with the water, you can uh, make a beautiful altar in, in your home or the place you live. You can put the four elements, you know, a little piece of, of uh, crystal, you know, some water in a beautiful way, maybe with some crystals inside, a beautiful feather of eagle or falcon or any other feather that you have it, a symbol of the earth, and of course, two or three candles or one candle representing the four elements of light. So this is one of the, the aspects who we need to connect in, in these days, you know, because Mother Moon is with us. And then on the other hand, it's very important to realize some meditation, to connect with our emotional process, how we are in our emotions, how is our solar plexus in this moment, we feel in peace, we feel in harmony, we feel balance. It's very important to connect with Mother Moon. Mother Moon is remember fertility, it's abundance, it's love, it's balance, it's harmony in our emotions. The water is connecting with that. But at the same time, it's very important to rediscover, you know, the spiritual essence of the water. As it's tested by even the physician tested, the water has an important role, of course, in all the planet. We are three quarters of the planet is water. We are 75% water. So in this time, in this uh, special moment, we invite you to open your hearts again to Mother Moon, to Mother Ixchel. Mother Ixchel, Mother Ixmukane, both represent one, the rivers, the streams, the lakes, the seas, the creeks, the waterfalls, the wells. This is Mother Ixchel is the one who is ruling those forces, but this ruling those forces not only outside, inside of you inside your blood, you know. It's very important to canalize in these days the energy to Mother Earth, Mother Moon, and to connect with another special being planet who is going to be Mars. Mars is going to be very active at the end of the, the month, and Mars represents the inner warriors. Mars represents that energy that is in combination of courage and brave and strength to decide to begin, really, really begin, your spiritual path with courage, with bravery, you know, to confront your path. And we are all passing these times, you know, situations around our family, our jobs, our business, our countries, our governors, uh, presidents, etc. So there are so much uh, places when you can see this is happening, you know. So we need to uh, invite ourselves to open our hearts to these dates when Mother Earth, Mother Moon is going to be very active and is precisely in this first month of the Maya and secondly, 
this, the second aspect to connect again with our inner warrior, who is Mars, who is that warrior within, who is represented in the Maya by the Jaguar. So let's, let's do uh, today a, a meditation connecting with these two great beings in our solar system. So I invite you to sit, to sit uh, comfortable, and to ask in this moment to Father and Mother, Father Sun, Mother Moon, imagining the solar system close by, the energy of the planet Mars. The Mayans call the planet Mars with the name of Chak Ek. Chak means red, Ek is the star or planet, the red planet. The energy of our blood, the energy of the inner warrior within you. Mother Moon, you are here with us in this time. Please guide us, guide us, Mother Moon. Mother Ixchel, Mother Ixmukane. Please give us in this time the great opportunity to work with your energies in this time to process any unbalance, any unharmony in our inner, our inner emotions, in our solar plexus. We're going to do a mantra to connect with our Mother Moon, and I invite you to see this beautiful energy from the moon in a silver color descending over your seven chakras, connecting with the heart of the earth with the Grandmother Shmukane. We're going to do this mantra asking our Mother Moon to connect with our inner warrior in our heart. you were there with us, taking care of the evolution of our bodies inside of the womb of the mother, and you are connecting with all creativity, with all the creation, human beings, animals, plants, minerals, all is in your, part of your control, mother, part of your soul. Ask our mother in shell in this moment to help us to release anything who is not in order, not in balance in our solar plexus. And we imagine a beautiful blue water descending in this moment over us. A beautiful, intense blue water who is washing from our top of the head all of our body, especially in the front and the back of the seven chakras. Receiving this blue energy, this blue water, cleansing and purifying our seven levels of energy, our seven chakras. For that, we are going to mantralize the mantra of the water, mantra hum. Ha, ha, ha. 
same time this blue blue intense color of the water over you is given fulfilling the area with profound carries profound love giving you the strength the balance the harmony that is needed participate of the energies of these days. If we see the symbol in the Maya of the red jaguar, who is in the inner chamber of Chichen Itza, the red jaguar representing the red color of the planet Mars with the eyes of the jade. We say in the mantra, Balam, Call our inner warrior. Balam, 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 energy with the red color, color of our heart beating and the connection with the heart of the sky, the heart of the earth. You are in perfect balance in your solar plexus with your emotions. Please Father, come, come, come Father, come, come, come Mother and help us, cleanse, cleanse us, help us to release and to cleanse our organs or our solar plexus from anything which is still there in another levels of energy, the spiritual or physical. Fulfill our solar plexus, fulfill our heart with the energy of happiness and love, kindness, peace, harmony. In these days, to connect with our mother, mother moon, to connect with our inner warrior, the Chawa, the Balam. We feel our energies in perfect balance. We see the gift of the water. We feel the energy of the warrior within. We say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To our Mother Moon, to our Mother Earth for to be with us and guide in these moments of meditation, to guide us in these days with the energies coming from the cosmos to our planet, that we can use well, we can use in perfect order, mentally, emotionally, you know, in different areas of our physical body, the organs transmute and transform those energies in perfect light, in perfect life, in perfect balance. We 
sent the same for our planet and all the living beings who are under the influence of Mother Moon and this, the influence of the planet Mars. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Father and Mother. To send love and light, abundance, harmony, peace, kindness to our planet without distinction of places, colors, nationality. Sending the Mayan message in Lakesh, Alakem, I am you, you are me. You are my other me. I love you as I love myself. I respect you as I respect myself. You can say now that these energies are in the planet. And we say, so we eat, so it is, it is done. So we eat, so it is, it is done. So we eat, so it is, it is done. In la cage, a la Take a moment for saying thank you to your spiritual guides, to your spiritual teachers, Father and Mother, Holy Spirit of God, for to guide us in this meditation and to receive the Maya connection the Maya sacred knowledge for these days. You can breathe in and breathe out slowly. When you feel right, you can open your eyes and to return to your consciousness. I just want to say that these days uh, we return to that area where always we were to feel confidence with our mother. And remember, to return to that wound of the mother is to, to be humble, to respect, love and honor the mother. And these influences, of course, are, are coming to our planet and affecting in some way us. So we are in balance, we do our meditation, the connection heart of the sky, heart of the earth, through our heart, through our seven chakras, we feel very good, but in balance, in harmony, and we can, at the same time, uh, cleanse, you know, and purify ourselves during these days with the water, you know, the aspect with emotions, and the connection with our inner water. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure. We'll, we'll see you soon. In La Cage.